We're at the flea market. We are. I see a, a spot over here with a bunch of stuff, so we're gonna go check it out. Look at all the little trinkets down there. Oh, wow. Oh, that's neat. Those are cool. His eye feels broken, though. What about the other one? He feels okay. Oh, my God. Oh wait, nope, his nose is broken. Oh yeah, that's cool. Oh, that's neat. Look, there's like I know all the <laughs> lobsters. That's really looks. cool. I like this light thing. Look at the brass owl, I think. Yep, I showed that. Look, there I am. This teapot. I've done good with those. Okay, I guess we can ask how much they are. She's got a pretty pedal wear plate. Yeah. Let's see. My mom loves these. You need a coral right there. Uh, oh, look at this big chicken. It's a sea terrine. Love it. And the last oh, one. This is cute. Gonna find I have a whole set of that little bunnies in there. That's cute. Yep. Bunny. Oh, and the little swan. Yeah. That's a good price for this. She doesn't have bad prices. Yeah, at least there's prices on them. Truth. On some of them. <laughs> Uh-oh. Did we knock over her tree? I don't think we did, but I'll fix it. It's kind of top heavy. That's pretty. Oh, God. Cute. Do you see anything you like here that you'd want to grab or? It's a cool car. I think this is actually pretty cool for three dollars over the bunny. As long as it's not chipped and broken. Italian pottery is always chipped. I can't see what I'm filming because the, the, sun, the screen brightness turned itself down. Okay, so probably grab that. I usually grab these for giveaways, but yeah. Okay, so I think I'm gonna grab this guy right here. Oh, that lamp is great. Kind of like pretty stuff over there. Hold on. I'm a minimalist. <laughs> That's cool. The prices aren't bad. Why are you a minimalist when you come to a flea market? I don't understand that. You come in the bottom jug. more of those plates. Different yeah, I was just design. looking. Those are cool. Like a jellyfish or something. Those prices aren't bad. No, no, that's not. It should be. That's a nice joke. But Pamela Hammett would like that. Only $9. That's cool. 
$4 apple. Okay. Those are pretty. It's, like I think it's a dove. 60. Could be. Yeah. Morning though? <laughs> Look at Yeah. I don't need two. That's cool. $3. Thanks. Yeah, like it's it's a Thanksgiving. Really old. Oh, here's another one. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That's cute. You can frame those. Halloween ones. Vintage toys. Look at this decanter. No, this one is. This is like one of those booklets like I have at home. Is there a price on here? I can't turn it the other way. No. That's cool. They need a lot of crazy, huh? Uh-huh. Oh, there it was, I think. I don't know what it says. It looks like it says $3, but... Well, I don't see. know. I like. Oh, well, I'm gonna knock that down. <laughs> I was trying to look at that this? that handle. Yeah. Turns out I think it's on the other side. Twenty five. That's cool. Yeah. Say that. Look at all the Viking and stuff. That's a cool piece with the hobnail. See anything you like, we can do a little better in all our prices. All right. Oh, yeah, look at that. Is it glass or acrylic? Acrylic. Oh. Mm -hmm. Hello. Oh, look at the Easter guys. That's a cool plane. Oh, and I like that. There. <laughs> that is a neat plane. That's some cool trucks. That's really ornate. Wouldn't have got any uh, knots out, but. Ten dollars, ladies, you can have the whole village. Hop to that rooster, that would have been nice. Everything on these tables is a dollar. Poor Lisa, she's all dirty. Oh, that's cool. Yes. Look at all the Easter toys. Paper mache guys. Look how cute. Oh, I love them. And a hen. All paper mache. Look at that guy. Oh, and I love that. All the craft stuff I could put in those. <laughs> oh, here's the the everything's Murano table. Mm, no. This way. Oh, it's busy today. Oh, here's some little glass things. I turned. I turned in my check out that stuff. Let me, let me see. Oh, and I see a pretty. Let me check the price on this. Purse, sixty-five. Nope. Oh, that's cool. I'm probably gonna have a problem with the wind. All right, everybody.
everybody here is the haul from the flea market so we hit a couple of different tables it's everything from like here over but we hit a couple of different booths that had some really good sales um one lady she's like i just want to go home so she was selling things real cheap but these are the things that we ended up getting um these looked very like between 1940s and like but then again in 1980s they brought that look back but they do look older to me so I do think they're older so I picked these up um I got these Art Nouveau sort of uh candlestick hold not sort of candlestick holders but candlestick holders I thought those were beautiful and then we got this piece of Fenton look at that you see the little logo on the bottom it's like that root beer color oh love it then this was interesting sorry I'm like I put it on my shelf and I was like Alex what are you doing you have to show this um it's ceramic and it's a decanter and it's floral and I thought it was amazing like the guy didn't know anything about it and neither did I we just both thought it was cool this is actually a piece of left in um it usually they're marked on the side Yes, it's, oh yeah, it's the Renaissance pattern. I almost said that and I thought I was wrong, but mm, hey, maybe I should listen to myself more often. <laughs> I got this piece of jadeite. It's not labeled anything at all, but it's a nice sugar dish with a lid. It doesn't have any damage. Picked up this beautiful piece. I need to clean it up a little bit, but it's gorgeous. Look at that. Love it. I got some Italian pottery. I actually picked up a piece at Red, White, and Blue that looks very similar to this. And Italian pottery is so delicate and fragile that a lot of times it's so broken. But it's in really good condition. It has lovely colors, so I had to pick that up. Then these are wheat and glass. These are uh, like presidential um, bottles. So each one of these little bottles has a U.S. president on it. But the colors are great. Like if someone likes to collect um, the different colored glass, and you could put them in your window. You know, they're great. So I didn't even, like, <laughs> they were inexpensive enough. I mean, there was a bunch of them. I could have bought all of them, but I didn't really want to get stuck with trying to unload all of them. She probably had like 20 or 30. So I just grabbed a couple of each color, <laughs> and then I left the rest there. Then we have this really cool art glass penguin. He has a gold in his belly. I thought he was really neat. So I got him. This is just a Japan piece. She is so cute. She's perfect for spring with her little sheep or her little lamb, whatever. Same difference, right? <laughs> then I absolutely love these luster wear. I love the different pieces, the birds. Just the different animals, the camels and all that stuff. So I went ahead and grabbed this one. I have some books that have like these in them. So then I got this brass frog with these green eyes. He's like a really heavy uh, brass. So I picked that up. Got a piece of California pottery. It's the sweetest little, I think it's a little cat. Um, it says California hand decorated D Lee art. Very cute. This is actually from a little thrift store around the corner from my house, but I put it in here. It's Beatrix Potter and it's with the Schmid company. Um, it's a little night light and you would have replaced the little battery in there. It's from, hold on. I can't see it with the shadow. 1990. And I know I'm, I have a, the light behind me, so, um, but she's cute. She's that bisque feeling, and so I don't want to touch her. <laughs> I added another lamp to my fairy lamp graveyard, or another shade. Then I got this. She can either be a, or this can either be a vase or a wall pocket. Very neat. And it says hand painted Japan right there. I got this this cat it does not have an interesting face for a cat 
It's got like a human nose and like human cheeks and it's supposed to be a cat. <laughs> I thought it was kind of interesting. And then the last thing we picked up were these really neat. These look very Asian to me, almost like a pagoda um, type roof, but they're candlestick holders. So we picked these up and um, I thought they were great. Now I haven't checked to see what glows, if anything, um, but I'm sure I'll let you guys know. A lot of this stuff is going to be available in our live sales. We host two of those every single week. Thursdays at 7 p.m., Sundays at 2 p.m. Eastern. Um, so I hope to see you guys there. Make sure you check those out. Um, but that's where you find a lot of this stuff, also in our eBay store, and the links for that are down below. So I think I will talk to you guys in another video. Thanks for watching. Butters, are you going to show everybody your fancy new bow tie? All the kitties got friend mail. Jesse Shops sh sent them all their own bow ties. Now they're hanging out in the studio watching birds and lizards. Are you busy? You working? I'm busy lady. <laughs> Cutie.